Trees, without a doubt, are a wonderful present from the nature. They provide us with much needed oxygen, minimize erosion, offer food, shelter to animals, and allow children to climb on them. Birds may create homes out of them as well. Although many trees provide practical benefits, certain ones have a dark side that can include murder, as well as one that causes suffering every year. In this video, we are going to unveil the most dangerous trees in the world that you should never touch. But before we do that, please subscribe Unimaginable and hit the bell icon for more updates. While we are not sure whether the man-eating tree exists in folklore, all of the trees we have considered in this video indicate that reality can be far stranger than fiction. So here are 15 most dangerous trees you should never touch. Number 15. Strychnine Tree Quaker buttons, strychnine tree, and poison nut are all names for the tree native to Southeast Asia and India, known as the Quaker button. It is small in stature and has leaves that grow up to three inches long, making it seem harmless. It may appear to be innocent and harmless, but do not be fooled by its charming appearance. This tree causes significant problems. The fruit of this tree is apple-sized and has a hard solid shell and soft white flesh with a jelly-like pulp in the center. This pulp contains five seeds that are soft and fuzzy. The various textures of fruit are frightening, but the seeds are even more so they are poisonous and contain strychnine, which has been used to poison arrows and to kill wild animals as bait. Number 14. Oleander Oleander is a lovely ornamental tree with a wide range of forms and sizes. It is so adaptable and diverse that it is frequently used in gardens by many people. However, failure to appreciate how harmful this plant can be might result in death. Most persons are not going to accidentally consume this plant because it has an unpleasant taste. But dogs, cats, horses, and cows are among the numerous animals that have died after eating it. Oleander is highly poisonous and may cause significant harm or death. Every single part of oleander is toxic, according to the National Institute of Health, so there is no avoiding its impact. Eating the stems, twigs, leaves, or flowers can be deadly. The sap might generate severe skin irritation if touched, and burning the plant may have an effect as well. Symptoms of poisoning include stomach pain, nausea, diarrhea, vomiting, vision blurring, depression, tremors, headache, low blood pressure, drowsiness, faintness, and confusion. Number 13. Sandbox here is a tree that you should avoid. While the sandbox tree may be amusing to youngsters, you shall want to keep clear of this deadly specimen. In fact, it is considered one of the most hazardous trees in the world because of its poisonous qualities. And it is not just dangerous for one reason, rather, numerous reasons combine to make it so. Take a look at the 90 to 130 foot tree spikes for starters. It has cone-shaped spines, which should be sufficient to keep you away from it. The seed capsules detonate with a bang when they dry and mature. The seeds of this tree are so fast that they fly through the air at up to 150 miles an hour, and they can reach distances of around 60 feet when flattened. Any person or animal that comes into their path is likely to be seriously injured, and this tree fruit is highly toxic and irritant. The fruit might induce cramps, diarrhea, and vomiting if eaten if you touch the sap. It may result in a red rash and even blindness if it gets in your eyes. Number 12. Toxic Manchineal Tree one of the most aggravating aspects of the manchineal is how benign it appears. It entices you with its beautiful green apples, and there are no indicators that it could do your severe damage, but it can. Because this tree has a toxin-filled milky white sap that covers everything from the bark to leaves and fruit, it is one of the most poisonous trees in the world. If you merely touch this tree, which is endemic to North and South America, it can induce severe blistering, but the suffering and risk do not end there. If you burn the tree, do not stop there. If you stay around to breathe in the smoke, it might result in significant eye injuries if it gets into your eyes. It can cause a burning and tearing sensation in the throat followed by bacterial superinfection, bleeding, and shock if ingested. Fortunately, if they are in populated regions, they have an X on them so you know to avoid them. The wood has been utilized for centuries by Caribbean furniture producers and the fruits have been dried and used as diuretics. Number 11. English Yew the English yew, also known as common yew, is a coniferous tree native to Europe, Africa, Iran, and Asia. It is an attractive ornamental tree that you should not touch because it is quite lovely, because they include taxine alkaloids, a type of poison, 
The entire tree, including the flesh of the berry that covers the seed, is poisonous. These chemicals are not angiosperms, but gymnosperms, which means these animals have been dying in droves and can also kill people owing to their cardiac arrest and respiratory failure. There are no known cures for the poisoning, but medicines like atropine can help with symptoms as severe as these. English yew tree was used to keep insects away because it had a strong odor, however. People cultivated them outside toilets since they were susceptible to rotting. Its wood is also very easy to work with, which contributed to its popularity among longbows and carpentry. Number 10. Sweet Cherry Trees Sweet cherry trees, also known as bird cherry and black cherry, are natives to many countries worldwide and have established themselves in several others. Because these trees bring a lot of advantages to the table, most people are cautious of them. This is due to the fact that all parts of the trees, with the exception of ripe fruit, include cyanogenic glycosides. Headaches, dizziness, nausea, worry, and in extreme situations death can occur as a result of ingesting enough bark or leaves. Although the chance of suffering severe side effects from eating too much bark or leaves is very small. Even though sweet cherry trees are poisonous, they are cultivated for a number of reasons. Their fruits have been consumed as food for thousands of years, and stones dating back to the Bronze Age have been discovered in piles. They are also grown as ornamental plants due to their attractiveness and ease of use in streets and gardens. Cherry wood, which is hard red-brown wood with a cherry aroma, is sought after by woodworkers who appreciate it for musical instruments, cabinets, and wood turning. Number 9. Moonlighter Jimpy the Moonlighter Gimpy, also known as Dendrochnide moroids and suicide plant, is a species of stinging tree from Australia. It is prevalent in the northeast rainforest regions of Australia and is the most toxic stinging tree species. Even though the fruit of this plant may be eaten by humans, it is only possible once the hairs are removed. If you touch leaves or branches with hollow silica, tipped hairs on them, they may penetrate your skin and inject toxins into your body. The pain from these stings can last for hours or even a couple of days days in certain circumstances. People who are stung by these trees have reported discomfort several months later when their affected area is exposed to temperature changes, water, or contact. When the sting happens, tiny red dots develop to form a well. When a lot of jimp is cut or cleared, the hairs can be released into the air. When workers do not use respiratory protection to remove them, they have reported sneezing, runny noses, nasal bleeding, and throat irritation. Number 8. Hemlock Hemlock, also known as Cania maculatum, is a herbaceous flowering plant or tree that is native to Europe and North Africa. It can grow up to 8 feet tall and has hollow green stems with red or purple streaks and tiny white flowers with small petals. Hemlock contains conium and other poisonous alkaloids that are harmful to all mammals and some animals that consume it. Cattle, pigs, horses, rabbits, sheep, goats, and others have all been affected by this little-known bloom. But do not assume humans are immune from poisoning. We are not. We do not usually eat wild plants and trees. A single plate of this dish can be fatal to a person. It has a very toxic effect on the kidneys that can lead to acute kidney damage and respiratory muscle paralysis, followed by death from oxygen deprivation. Number 7. Namibian Bottle Tree the Namibian bottle tree may reach a height of up to 6 meters. Its trunk is reminiscent of a thick bottle, then tapers off at the top with merely a few branches. The branches of the tree that do show up at the top are often thorny and even furry. It is a comical tree, similar to the milky mangrove. If you get hit in the eyes with this Namibian bottle tree, it can cause permanent blindness due on its watery latex fluid, which is high in deadly alkaloids. The latex of this tree may be used for poison in Namibian villages of northern Angola and southern Angola, where it grows frequently. These trees are native to arid, rocky hillsides and dried bush fields. They develop at elevations ranging from 1,000 to 1,600 meters above sea level and can survive temperatures as low as negative 10 degrees Celsius to 45 degrees Celsius. Because wild plants are destroyed for trade when they grow old, there are not enough young plants available. Number 6. Coconut Tree a coconut tree has no deadly poisons, pointed spikes, or vomit-inducing sap, so it appears to be harmless. 
However, coconuts are hazardous. There have been several research projects conducted over time in order to determine how many people are injured or killed from coconut trees, but the results have varied greatly. In 2002, authorities in Queensland, Australia were so concerned about the risk of injury and death that they removed coconuts from their beaches. A newspaper even termed coconuts a deadly fruit, pointing to research findings known as injuries caused by falling coconuts, which was published in the Journal of Trauma. According to the researcher, 2.5% of all trauma admissions in Papua New Guinea over four years were due to falling coconuts. A coconut falls from a tree with roughly 2,000 pounds of force, and you would certainly sense it if it landed on you. Many papers have further claimed that you are more likely to die from a falling coconut than a shark bite. Number 5. Milky Mangrove the milky mangrove is a tree that is also known as blind your eye mangrove. This tree has such harmful chemicals in it that when its latex comes into contact with your eyes, you can end up blind. It thrives in tropical mangrove swamps in India, Bangladesh, and Australia. The milky mangrove required protection since many organisms feed on trees to survive. It also grows up to 15 meters tall and may be either male or female. The males have drooping tassel flowers, while the females have short spikes. It causes irritation and excruciating blistering when it comes into contact with your skin. When the plant comes into touch with your eyes, it can cause blindness. The smoke from burning the wood may lead to permanent blindness, although this is relatively uncommon. If you burn the leaves, the poison remaining in the ash can cause long-term blindness. Number 4. Horse Chestnut it is best to avoid the tiny berries on a horse chestnut tree, which are just as delectable as the big ones. These seeds may be useful, but only if they are not consumed raw. They can cause terrible thirst, nausea, vomiting, and in the worst cases, paralysis and death. Surprisingly, these trees are quite prevalent to find. They were developed in the Pacific Northwest because of their gorgeous blooms. They are also quite common in Vancouver, New Zealand, and the United Kingdom. Fortunately, you would not eat the seeds of a horse chestnut tree since they are quite distinctive. They are enormous, bright green trees that grow up to 128 feet long and have lovely white blooms with stunning pink splotches. The fruit has large green spiky shells. The alkaloid saponins in the seeds make them poisonous. The fruit is more potent if it is fresh. It is only the seed you have to be careful about. Number 3. Socotra Dragon Tree the Socotra dragon tree, also known as the dragon blood tree, is a magnificent umbrella-like tree that may reach up to 30 feet tall and live for 600 years. The sap of this plant, which is where the name comes from, has been used for hundreds of years in items like varnish, medicine, and even lipstick. It is not poisonous, but you should avoid touching it because it is at risk of going extinct. This tree is found on one island in the Socotra Archipelago in the Arabian Sea off Yemen coast. They are endangered by logging, overgrazing of seed, and shoot by cattle and habitat fragmentation. Even though new trees are sprouting, they are rarely mature due to these factors. However, climate change is driving the dragon blood tree to additional difficulties. Researchers believe that at least 45% of its current range will be lost by 2080 as a result of climate change. Number 2. Poison Ivy It is an allergic-inducing flowering plant that is extremely inconvenient. If you touch it, you may get dermatitis and an itchy and painful rash. This reaction is caused by the erushiol in the sap of ivy, which contains a chemical called erushiol. There are many different types of poison ivy to avoid, making avoiding them far more difficult. They are generally known by their three-lobed leaves. They usually have three leafy branches and grow on trees, shrubs, or trailing vines. They are frequently identified by their triangular leaves. Not many people are aware that poison ivy can act kind of like a tree. If an ivy plant germinates near a tree, it may quickly develop into an aggressive woody vine that takes on the shape of a tree, almost becoming an extension of the tree. As a result, there have been many scenarios where individuals have grabbed some leaves from a tree to pull down a branch only to realize it was poison ivy that had transformed into a tree. Number 1. Suicide Tree the suicide tree is not its formal name, but you shall find out why the Cerbera odalum is known as suicide tree. It grows in India and parts of Southern Asia. Some people use it for hedge purposes, although it is perfectly safe if left alone and not consumed. This plant has been a popular choice among those who want to kill themselves or commit murder for quite some time. The tiny kernel is encased in the fruit is hard outer shell. This kernel includes cerberin a poison that prevents your heart muscle calcium ion channels from working. This can cause the heart to stop beating and result in death. 
Vomiting is one of the most common signs of consumption, but it is difficult to spot this kernel in autopsies. It is also simple to disguise the flavor with strong seasonings. As Wikipedia notes, this is why it was so popular in India for murder and suicide. A single kernel might be deadly. Death can occur after just two days of eating it. People who eat a kernel will get a burning sensation in their mouth, vomiting, and irregular breathing before dying or going into a coma. The moral of the video is if you cannot identify a plant or tree, do not touch it. Some trees would prefer to terminate your existence than restore it. Have you seen any of these trees in person before? Do tell us in the comment box. Thanks for watching the video and do not forget to like the video. See you next time.